Whichever one of these four artists makes the best portrait of me wins five grand for their sibling. Whoa! You have five hours, the time has officially started. For your references, you have five minutes with me. Oh. So in the previous video, we all did training. Michelle was dead last. Ben and Jake were tied for third. David came in second and I won. But I'm not competing today. I see Zach every day. I think I know what his face looks like. But in the last challenge, I didn't do so well. Ben's probably just gonna do a mediocre portrait and then draw a dragon to make up for it. Did you see your character shirt of Zach in the school video? No, it was beautiful. Wait, these are really- I'm scared to start, oh my god. How do you think your students are gonna do today? Um, I'm really rooting for Ben because yesterday I feel like he felt horrible after. What about Michelle? She's a serious underdog here. I heard her saying that she sees your face every day. That does not matter. I think I struggled in the training video because the other artists are just way more talented. But today, I have more time to work on my piece. How is everyone? Help! Help! <laughs> don't go into any detail until you have the big shapes. I don't know if that helps. <laughs> so far, it's good. Go a little further for me to judge. Whose face looks really good? Probably Ben. <laughs> Ben, how are you feeling? I think five minutes yesterday for the other training was like too little time for me, so I think five hours is enough time. So what the contestants don't know is that they will actually each get five minutes of fun's time throughout the challenge, and they can use that at any point. Imagine like I do Michelle's and it's like one eyeball very realistic and the rest of <laughs> That might be cool. Though. All she needs is that one good eye. I want to win money for my siblings. I don't know which one yet, so uh, maybe they'll have to sweet talk me and I'll pick from there. If you had to give one general piece of advice to all four artists, Artists, what would it be? The first hour is the most important because that's where you get all your shapes and your proportions down. It's much more important to have a great foundation before you get into shading. I wonder how much detail they're gonna add because I have a couple pimples today, so yeah, I'm not looking the most attractive. So I wonder if they include that. <laughs> I'm including all the pimples. I really want to win this challenge because I really want to win money for my little sister. She's a Sagittarius like me. They have been doing their portraits for approximately 22 minutes. It is time to announce the first twist of this video. At any point, you get Devon for five minutes. I want Devon right now. I want Devon I think I'll take him last. Jake, so you call Devon's help first? Yes. You get five minutes. Your time's already started. You need to tell Devon exactly what you want. You can't just tell him to do the drawing for you. I need help with the proportions of the face, everything about it. What was wrong with Jake's drawing at the beginning? Everything. Huh? How are you gonna use Devon? Map out my proportions. Yeah, Devon completely start over, so I don't shadows. think Jake had him start over, I think Devon chose to start over. Hands up! How are you feeling about it? I'm feeling really confident. Does this look more accurate? If the angle is just harder, this is like way easier. When I help you, you should have me like do that one. Here's your chair. Wait, Ben, are you using your five minutes already? Yeah. I think if you could just fix it up and then add the shadows. Do you think the nose is fine? No. David's portrait should, looks like the Chucky doll. You didn't even draw any of that. I think Devon did a great job, so. By the end of this, Devon's gonna be an expert at drawing me. Three, two, one, all right. Apparently all my proportions were wrong, so this was much needed. I think you need to measure out your proportions. I, I feel like I look like a Star Wars creature. That's why Devon's gonna come and help me really soon. That's Zach. That's the drawing. Huh? It doesn't look like Zach. I think I can come back from this. Everyone look up at the clock. It is time. We have our first challenge, so let's head to the other room. I'm so sorry. God, yours looks like Zach. You still have Devon's help. I want the middle, but Jake took it. I'm in the corner. Position is very important here. You do not want the corners. Well, great! In front of you guys are giant sheets of paper and a giant pencil. You guys will have three minutes to draw Devon's portrait. Devon, come sit over here. Wait, oh my god, okay, wait. <laughs> ah, I didn't learn this in class yesterday. <laughs> this looks not good. This is extremely hard. That's what she said. I gave him a big chin. Pick up the pencils. I don't think I captured right, so his beauty, one, guys. Oh, that was so hard. Devon and I are gonna go take a look at these pieces. I like the whole avatar look. Isn't like the airbender or avatar? Isn't like the blue people? The, blue people. <laughs> <laughs> the eyes are very close together. <laughs> There's something really artistic about this that I like. I, I drew the hat instead of the eyebrows. Michelle, Michelle, Michelle. I call it Picasso, Devon. See, I don't think this is one of Michelle's stronger ones. So Devon, pick your favorite one. I choose Jake. Yes! In your faces. Jake, since you're the winner, choose who's gonna be safe with you. Michelle. <laughs> All right, Michelle, you're safe. David and Ben, play rock, paper, scissors to see who has to use a giant pencil for 30 minutes. Bruh. I'm gonna do scissors. Oh, the mind oh, game. That's my tactic. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Ah! All right, Ben, what are you gonna do this time? Paper. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Let's go! You got the giant pencil for 30 minutes. Let's go back to the drawings. Well, I was kind of hoping Ben would get it because his drawing was so 
good. That was the most intense game of rock, paper, scissors I've ever played. I have to use this disgusting, huge pencil. I feel like this is just an automatic, like, 30 minute time deduction. I think it's time to get Devon's help. You ready? But I want to restart. No! It looks like the biggest struggle from everyone at the moment are the proportions of my face. Something about my face being slightly lopsided. He's throwing everyone off. Oh, I definitely made Zach's face too big. I always see him as a little bit more chubby. Hey! So I actually feel like I've lost a little bit of fat. You have squishy cheeks. I, I've been hitting the gym regularly. Okay. Squishy cheeks. Time's up. It looks really freaking good. I gave good. you an extra 10 seconds to be nice because you need it. <laughs> In the kinetic sand video, I wasn't able to win money for my brother. Hopefully this time, I'll be able to get the dub and get him some cash. Jake, I think this big pencil was an advantage. I think you should keep telling yourself that. I think I will. Everyone, it is time for challenge number two. Come with me. Oh for this next challenge, you guys will have five minutes to draw a turkey. You guys are going to erase drawings of turkey, if that makes sense. Your time has started. I don't even have to look at turkey because I draw him for a living. Jake, you don't have a lot down. I'm getting a little worried for you. What do you mean? All right, final seconds. Come on, finish it up. Three, two, one. Erases down. Shoot. Let's take a look at it. Michelle, cute. I like it. Jake, what, what is that? that? I don't Jake, want to talk about, about it. Cute, David. Ooh, very nice, Ben. I think Ben's had a more creative element to it. He added his own touch. David copied turkey a little bit better, but I'm sorry, David. I'm going to have to give it to Ben. Yeah! I like his better. That was a close one. I really need to start winning one of these mini challenges. How squishy is that? So squishy. Very close. David, how cute does he look? He's the cutest. Well, you can get him at chcstore.com. All right, ah. someone catch him. Ooh. Here's your advantage. On the face, there are a couple different features. There's the lips, the nose, the eyes, the ears. You can choose one feature to erase. Oh, someone else is drawing? Yeah. So you may not erase anything but that one feature. I already have my decision. It's Jake, isn't it? Who thinks of these things? The ironic thing to answer your question. Jake actually came up with this idea. Kiss that nose goodbye, Jake. You know what? Goodbye, Goodbye, nose. Bye, nose. What is this? That's not the nose. Huh? Can you smell anything? Because <laughs> you don't have a nose. <laughs> not even gonna lie, I felt great to erase Jake's nose. Zach said I made him look like a K-pop star, but this is how I actually see him. Literally perfect. Okay. I don't think it's gonna be that hard to revive this nose, but it's definitely not ideal. I'm having a little bit of trouble, so now I'm gonna use Devon to come in and really give his face like the structure that it needs. Devon! Carve out the side of his face and like the jaw, because all of that's confusing. Yay! Portrait queen, help me. I think you need to give the eyes a little more shading. I hope with Mackenzie's advice, I'll win. I'm gonna prove that I'm not a terrible artist. Just kidding, probably am. But I wanna be better than yesterday, at least. Personally, I'm getting kind of bored. Is it because of the drawings? <gasps> no, it's not because of oh, the drawings. Okay. <laughs> it's because it's taken a while. And so, I bought us a little toy. Oh, we go up onto the roof and we can point it at their drawings and mess with them. Oh, perfect. So we have two of them. This is restricted area. Not anymore. <laughs> this way, up here. I'm pretty sure we're authorized. Oh my God. This is crazy. Bruh. <laughs> I have no idea why I'm having so much fun messing with them right now. We did it for too long and then they all just looked up. Wait, I have an idea. I guess not big enough. Sex being a child. Without thinking that to get too far. Jake, how's your drawing going? That was dirty. Look at how wet that is. I grabbed it right as it was I was throwing it and it was in the air. He grabbed it away and it hit the wood. <laughs> that was so rude. That one was you. No, that was you! Zach, I restarted your left eye. You just look like a random Asian dude, and I realized I had to shift it left and make it bigger. I'm so impressed with your comeback. Are you? Yeah. All right, everyone, look up at the clock. Actually, I'm not sure why I told you to look up at the clock. We're actually gonna do a mini challenge. Follow me. Mini challenge. Trust me, Michelle, you're gonna wanna win this one. I think if you win this mini challenge, you can win this whole thing. <laughs> if I win it. Let's go, Michelle, I'm rooting for you. So in front of each one of you is a pencil and a pencil sharpener, and this is a stubby pencil. You're gonna sharpen your pencil until it gets to this size. First person to finish wins. You may begin. Jake, how is yours so messy? My little hand. And if you don't win, just don't get last. Is this it? Nope, not quite, okay, Jake. Me, Too me, short. Me, 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 Let me Nope. This, this, this. You got it, Jake. Right, it. It. You got it, Ben. Yeah. You got it, David. Okay. Michelle. 
you're a disadvantage. Oh. You see the stubby pencils on the floor? Yeah. You gotta use those. Are you joking? Nope. No, no Michelle. Not the stubby pencils. And for your advantage, right. you get to vomit for five more minutes. Really? At any point. I didn't need the advantage. However, I really wish I didn't have to use the stubby pencils because that is a game changer. I asked Devon to do the hair, but he's actually just doing a little bit of everything, which I'm not complaining about. All right, Devon, time is up. Why don't you walk over to each person, give them one or two things they could work on for the final 20 minutes. Under his eye, it, sh it should be like more space of whites. I want you to win. You make the shadows darker. I don't know what else to say. It's not perfect. Add a shadow to like the yeah. middle of, yeah, where it like goes in a little bit. That shape where you have all black, make it as dark as possible. Fill in like every little spot. Everyone's doing really good. The competition is strong here between you two. I'm rooting for David and Jake, but since I coached Jake a little bit more, I'm rooting for him. <laughs> Sorry, David. I thought the stubby pencils were gonna be bad, and it actually helped darken my piece a little bit. So maybe I needed the stubby pencils. I would date him. Five, four, three, two, one. Time's up. All right, let's take a look at these. Here's how we're gonna judge them. Devon, Mackenzie, and I, we're gonna go around, look at each one of your pieces, and give it a score out of 10. Whoever ends up having the most points wins. We're gonna start with Ben over here. It looks overall exact, but I think the whole thing is like too gray. I feel like it should have more contrast. Uh, 6.9. Okay, I think the same thing as Devon, but overall I really like the shading. 8.5. Oh, oh wow. wow. Yeah. I'm gonna give you a 7. 22.4. 22.4 uh, for Ben. Hi, Michelle. What I love about it is the proportions are good. It looks like Zach. You should hang this in your home. A 4.8. Oh. And I think oh. Zach's lips look a little darker than in the reference. So I gave you a 5. Yay! Yes. Big improvement. I think everyone can agree on that. I would say yours looks one of the closest to mine in terms of proportions. So I gave you a 6.9. Yay! Yay. David, I'm so happy that I told you to change the reference because Thank God. What you were doing on that last portrait was... I would have given you like a four. Yeah. I love that you got the dark shadows here, mm -hmm. the darkness of the eyes, the hair. 8.4. Yay! Uh, I really like the shading. The lips look really good. The eyes are good. 9.5. Yes! Oh my Thank goodness, you. that is a high score. Just like Devon, I am so glad you changed your reference because at some point I look like E.T. Yeah. You have some very nice highlights and I feel like when I step back it really pops out. I gave you an 8. Yay! Thank you. 25.9 for David. Okay, yes! Jake, I love how dark you went on the eyebrows, the eyes, and the hair. Relax, the jaw is awesome. <laughs> you did the jaw at the end! Well, I only had two minutes and I was working with this, so... <laughs> <laughs> it looks amazing, and you got a 7.7. .7. This was a really hard angle. But overall, you did really good, so I gave you a 7.5. Thanks. I think you did a good job. You took a couple L's this video, but I think you came back strong. You chose one of the more difficult angles, and while I applaud you on challenging yourself, I think in this case, certain parts it look like you struggle with in terms of proportion. I give you a 7.5, which means... David, yes. come forward. You're the winner yes. of the challenge. Yes. David, do you have anything to say to your sister before you pick a card? You're a queen and you're a Sagittarius and I play when you lots of money. In here are a ton of sheets of paper, anywhere from $1,000 to $5,000, whatever you choose, she wins. 5,000, 5,000. 5,000. I just bought a ton of ice. We even have blow torches and chainsaws. This is gonna be crazy. We have six artists and six giant blocks of ice. You will all be making ice sculptures. Whoever has the best one after six hours will win up to $5,000. It's for a subscriber. You don't wanna lose. We just bought a new dunk tank. Ah! Right, you guys ready for a safety lesson? Nope. A lot of stuff is gonna kick up from the ice. Safety glasses, they're fashionable and practical. Anybody use one of these? Michelle. Six hours starts now. We were just taught how to use the blow torches, and honestly, I'm a little scared. I'm gonna be good. What is wrong? I need with a you? thing. Jess, what's the what? plan for this challenge? I don't know exactly what I'm gonna do, but I think I'm gonna just try to learn some techniques so that I don't just crack my piece and it collapses. <laughs> what's the plan for your ice sculpture? These chainsaws are really loud. And I thought maybe I'll do a unicorn, like on its tiny leg. 
Kenzie already chipping away at it. I'm going to try and make a head of a horse. Like this will be like the mane and then this will be the head. All right, Michelle, what is your plan? So I want to do something very simple. Mm -hmm. I'm going to make a rubber duck. All right, that's pretty cool. I guess we'll see how you execute that. So I see Jake making a Venus flytrap. Jake, that looks very ambitious. Oh yeah, I know. I said it was going to be very ambitious, but you know, I'll give it a try. Ben, tell me about what you're going to be making. I think I want to make a fish. Oh, that's really cool. Do you think you're going to be able to execute it well? Absolutely not. Izzy, you changed your mind already? I just talked to you three minutes ago. So I feel like a dragon would be cool. A dragon would be cool. I just finished my very rough sketch, and now I'm just going to go in and start chopping off chunks. I'm using my ice pick as a little stabber. Artists, we have a mini challenge right now. Present to me the most perfect little ice cube. Winner gets an advantage. <laughs> oh, <laughs> did so. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop what you're doing. All right, Ben, not, not bad. bad. Jake's is really nice. It's, it's, it's a little bit more of a rectangle. Wait, I Michelle think. has a perfect little cube. Look at that. Wait, I can't even pick it up. No! Oh, <laughs> oh my God, it just melted. <laughs> right, it's okay. It's, yeah, it's just a piece of ice. <laughs> Michelle, you win this challenge. We have two bags of snow in the back. But both it's bags of ice need to be dumped on someone. On someone? I have more faith than Mackenzie and Izzy would. So we're gonna go for Mackenzie and Izzy? Yeah. All right, Michelle. Oh. 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 Do it. It's too cold. Oh. 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 It's so no. cold. Where's Izzy? Where's I found her. Izzy, get back here. Oh. Oh. I can't even see my sketch. My cell ran out of battery, so I guess for the moment, I'm just going to use some hand tools. Just tell me how it's going so far. Okay, so I finally figured out how to make it functional and a creature. Awesome. I'm gonna make it into a koi fish, Water. and oh I'm gonna try to make like a little loose, like a little spout for drinking. Oh, I see the head already. Yeah, it's gonna be a head. That is really cool. I wanna give it like a snake body. How's your sculpture going so far? I think it's going pretty good. I'm working on the head shape oh, for the feet. Oh, it. It's still kind of unsturdy, but it's a lot better than what it was before. So how are you gonna form the duck? I don't see it so far. Oh, so this is the head. Oh, I'm gonna... I see. The belt on my little hand chain saw decided to break. And the battery's charging, so I'm just doing this. Okay, put your safety goggles back on. Looks like you're making progress. I see you're the only one using the mallet. Yeah, I didn't get a hammer, I got a mallet. Artist, stop what you're doing. So whoever sacrifices the biggest chunk of ice right now gets this ice pick to use in someone's sculpture. Does anyone want to cut a piece out? Yeah, All right, Michelle's in the one. lead. All right, Michelle, you get 10 seconds with this. Oh Find one person, you can stab it as many times as you oh want. My God. Four, three, two, one. All right, Michelle, oh, stop. Michelle just went like psycho on <laughs> I got a whole grandpappy needs, so I'm gonna go grab myself a stool. I actually took a whole entire chunk of my fish's tail out. In just a moment, I will be connecting you guys with subscribers because, because the money you win will be going to a subscriber. We have big old blocks of ice here, and if I win, I get the chance to win up to five thousand dollars for you. Oh my gosh, that's so awesome. Hi, <laughs> I'm Izzy. And if I win, you can win up to five thousand dollars. Thank you. We are doing a crafts video right now, and we are doing ice sculptures. Oh, sorry, I wish you the best of luck. Okay, thank you. So nice talking to you. And we're making ice sculptures. Yeah, yeah, I know. I'm really gonna try. Um, this, this is the one you win. <laughs> yes! And, uh, I'm making a fish, but if I win, um, I have the chance to win up to $5,000 for you. That That's crazy. Yeah. Well, good luck. Good luck. A duck. <laughs> it doesn't look like a duck yet. came out, it's getting really warm. My dragon is starting to kind of melt. All right, stop what you're doing and come with me. The first person to finish their Slurpee wins something, and the last person to finish their Slurpee also wins something. No! All right, go. What? Oh, I'm gonna go melt my Slurpee with a blowtorch. Hello. Ah, shoot. What on earth? Jake, what are you doing? Jake, 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 it's on fire. It's on fire. It's not on fire. Jake! <laughs> what? Oh my god! 
Jess, you're first. Woo! All right, I just can't be last. Izzy is done. Oh, all right, Ben is done. Okay. Mackenzie is done. Michelle's done. Oh, no. oh, what do I get? What do I get? Jazz, you're the winner, so everyone, come outside. Take that large chunk of ice, and you can throw it at any one of these as hard as you can. I do remember Mackenzie saying that her sculpture was leaning. Oh. Maybe if I throw it like hard enough, it'll do it something. Oh, well, Jazz took out a pretty good chunk. Would you say sometimes you get cold feet? I have no idea what you're talking about. All right, Jake, you want yourself another Slurpee. However, your feet will be in a bucket of ice until you finish this. Uh, oh, oh. <laughs> what? Since when was that also included? Now I'm really freezing everywhere. Well, Viviana, things aren't quite going the way that I expected, but hopefully I'll still end up on top. Eliza, I'm working super hard to win this for you. The ice is melting, it's cracking, but that's not stopping up. I'm really struggling because my ice is just completely cracked all over the place. All right, Ben, how's your fish going? It actually looks pretty decent from this side. Yeah. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get to the other side. Jake's? Looks like trash. Oh my goodness, Michelle, the duck's coming along. Yeah. Well, the head took four hours. I'm defining the dragon's body more because I think that's the part oh, you can really Oh, wait, jump. I didn't even see it from this side. This is a better side. Ooh, I like that. I didn't mean to put my shirt on backwards. Oh my gosh! There's a bug buried inside my eyes. I've come to the conclusion that the only thing that I can make is an iceberg. It's gonna be pretty realistic if you ask me. Hey Ben, that's a good way to break the ice. I only have an hour left. I'm currently working on the waves. It's not exactly how I planned it to be. <sighs> all right, so my sculpture is all done. I am all done sculpting. I'm all done with my sculpture, and this is how it turned out. Jess, tell me about your piece. Okay, so this is like my cartoon-style koi fish. You scaled it out. Yeah. <laughs> I said that I wanted to do in the beginning was make it oh. like functional. So hold this it underneath cool. right here. Is this supposed to chill my drink? Oh. Ah, it's yeah. actually kind of cold. That's cool. <laughs> oh yeah, I like how it's functional. Very nice, Jess. Good job, I like it. All right, Izzy. So Whoa. I made a curling dragon. That kind is of very like... impressive how you got the entire form of the dragon in. It was just a shame that, that you can see Michelle's dent right here. Yeah. Good job, Izzy. Mackenzie, tell me about this. This is a chess piece. So it's the knight. So the ears here, then you got the eyeball. I don't it looks pretty nice. I, I would have liked to see a curve over here a bit more. It looks kind of just like a flat piece right now. Good job, Mackenzie. All right, Michelle. I did a little rubber ducky on top of me. Oh, you didn't give the duck an eye. It would have broke the head. <laughs> However, I would say it's really impressive how you got a sphere up here. Yeah, you got the nice shape of the duck. What yeah. I would have liked to see is a couple cuts through the wave to show it's like a wave rather than just like a flat block. You did really well, Michelle. Good job. Well, 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 Jake, tell me about your ice sculpture. We have a very realistic iceberg. As you can see, <laughs> different crevices and textures that uh -huh. an iceberg would have. Yes, I what see. went wrong? Everything, apparently. We'll give it up for Jake. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Jake. Ben, what is this? It's an angelfish coming out of the water, and you can only look at it from this side. <laughs> <laughs> right, I will stick to this side. Good. Yeah, I tried. Um, These are supposed to be splashes on the bottom, but the drips kind of like broke off. Ben, I'm surprised the middle didn't break. The wave actually turned out really good. Are you sure that's not another iceberg? <laughs> All right, good job, Ben. Cool. Obviously, now we have to start eliminating. This is a very hard decision. Jake, you are eliminated. <laughs> what? I had the most realistic piece. Next person we are eliminating. Ben. Unfortunately, you have been eliminated. <laughs> Mackenzie, say goodbye to your chess piece and hello to the ice dunk tank. Jazz, as much as I liked 
the function of your ice sculpture. I feel like the form of the fish wasn't quite there. So unfortunately, I'm going to eliminate you. And finally, the winner will be decided through a poll by my subscribers. Michelle, you think you know what the subscribers are gonna be choosing? Yeah. <laughs> they have indeed made a decision. Winning with a percentage of 80%. <laughs> is Michelle? No. Michelle? No. Michelle? Stop. Shake Izzy's hand. <laughs> because Izzy's going to the ice tank to dunk you in. <laughs> Coming. Okay, yeah, Izzy, you won. Yeah! 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 Nice! Everyone else, buy the dunk tank. Yeah. Are you ready, Izzy? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> have one more person going. It's called a double dip. What? I'm thinking of a number from one through five. Oh, Everyone, four. four. The number was two, which means Mackenzie, you get the second <laughs> one. Ah! What in the world? And you guys think I'm a We have seven artists and you will be making art out of one million dots. In front of you are seven sheets of paper. Over here, we have pens, we have markers, we have pencils, anything to, well, Dots. Rules are, you can only use one dot at a time. You can only use one pen or marker at a time. I'm still traumatized by our last video oh. with dots. You have six hours and whoever has the best piece will win up to $5,000 per subscriber and a little something for yourself too. So all the losers are gonna lunge up the entire hill. Uh. Are you all ready? Yes! Go! Last time uh, I did this was the 100 million dots video and I can still hear the doing 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 I get the point, Zach. <laughs> what do you plan on dotting? I have a lot of colors, so I feel like I want to make some optical kind of trippy optical illusion. I was gonna do Lisa, and I wanted to make her almost look like a beautiful, like goddess statue. But you don't have to change anything about that. You just... You're right. Okay. Yeah, you're cheating. I'm gonna be dotting money. I'm making a tree. Yeah. I'm going to be dotting a macaw. A flower? I'm doing a video game character. Wait, I'm confused. What's going on? We are going to go down the row really? this way and go around. Close your eyes. We're going to do a whole Rooney. Viv, take a topic. All right, Viv, you're doing flowers. Money. Rawr. You're doing a video game character. <laughs> I'm doing Lisa. Oh, I knew it. I was going to get jazzes. Yeah! <laughs> a tree! And that means, Izzy, you're gonna be doing a bird. Ooh, I love birds. Just so you know, in Lisa. Black Pink's most viewed music video, Lisa is holding a bird. All right, everyone, close your eyes. Something happens to the person that grabs the orange pencil. There's only one left. Alright, everyone, look at your pencil. You know how each of you guys are always paired with a subscriber? Well, this time we're doing it a little bit differently. Michelle, you will be paired with two subscribers. Oh. So whatever you win for your subscriber is double. That's a lot of pressure. And the interesting thing is, I just ate subscribers, so all of them are gonna pick who they want to be partnered up with. What is your name and where are you from? I'm Joel and I'm from Israel. We're doing a pointillism crafts challenge, so we're making art just like using dots. And if I win, you'll have the chance to win up to $5,000. Tell him that you have to do your best, don't get distracted. So I'm basically doing this picture and I added birds over it. Do it. Just believe in yourself. I had like the base. Mackenzie's not with options because she's awful. I hate you, Charles. Statistically speaking, you have the highest. Oh, shut up. Oh, no. no. This tree you're working on right now. So, this is the tree of life. The roots aren't going to be just like brown and like green. It's going to be like a mandala. Whoa, that looks nice so far, Izzy. Thank you. I think your main struggle is going to be time. I agree. Okay, Viv, so you're changing it so that Lisa's in the rose? Yes. Whoa, Jake! That's actually pretty cool. I think it'll turn out cool as long as I can finish it. It's a race against time for me over here. Michelle, a money sign? Yeah. Are you gonna do anything else? This is it, because I'm gonna finish, unlike everyone else. Mackenzie, let me see yours so far. It's a work in progress. 
Ooh, Ben, that looks kind of cool. You like the trippy face? That's nice so far. Artists, over here I have an electric pen. This can make a ton of dust every second. Oh. We're gonna bring in rock, paper, scissors. If you beat me, you get one of these. <laughs> if you lose, you have to lunch twice around the house. No, no. No. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! Oh, Michelle! You get an electric pen! Yeah! Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! Jess, rock, paper, scissors, shoot! Can I do it? Scissors first? cuts paper. Yeah. All right, everyone, go to your lunges! Oh. Oh, Zach, I'm so sore! Oh, I'm not doing legs today. I didn't stretch before these. Is it two These aren't even real lunges. A little cold. Oh. Oh, I'm stretch first then. No! Ah! Oh, this hurt! This is so difficult. Wow, Michelle's going so fast now. I'm so sweaty from all those lunges, but here's the progress that I have on my tree so far. I'm doing multiple colors to fill in it. Almost done with Lisa's face. I think we can actually win with this. Give me a number. Three. 49. 12. 7. 52. 25. 73. If you said an odd number, you get an electric pen. Yeah! Mackenzie and Viv, unfortunately, since you guys chose an even number, you guys are stuck with what you have. All right, Ben, tell me how you're doing so far. The little pattern optical illusion thing is kind of hard to figure out. Tell me how it's going. It's taking a lot longer than I thought it was going to. Do you kind of wish you had the electric pen? Yeah, that would be really nice right about now. Jake, that video game character looks so scary. It looks like the Annabelle doll. Michelle, very nice. Thank you. Viv, this looks nice so far. Thank you. Izzy, did your pen die? No, but I'm just using this pen for right now. It looks like you still have a ways to go. Yeah. Jess, how's your tree going? It's going well. You're covering a lot of ground, but you haven't gotten to the ground yet. <laughs> yes. If you remember Steve from some of the OG videos, yeah, he's going to be the okay. guest judge. Hi, guys. Steve, since you're the guest judge for today, you get to pick their next punishment. You have your drunken goggles. That's actually not a bad idea. Artists, I'm going to give each one of you a piece of paper. You're going to have three minutes to make art out of dots. The best four are going to be safe. The bottom three will be wearing drunk goggles and drawing for the next 30 minutes. Oh my god. Ready, go! Five, four, three, two, one. Everyone stop. Alright, Steve, I drew a school. That's pretty much it. I drew an eyeball. A banana. <laughs> Some cherries. <laughs> an eye. <laughs> I also drew an eye. I don't know if the next one's gonna be a fruit. And I drew an apple core. <laughs> Take one person that's safe. Alright, Ben, you're safe. You jazz is safe. Oh. Yeah. I like her apple core. Maybe it has a deeper meaning that I can't comprehend. They did is safe. Mackenzie's safe. Unfortunately, that means Izzy, Michelle, Jake, drunk goggles for you. 30 minutes starts now. You look like a little alien. <laughs> wait, wait, Jake, you won that video. Yeah. I beat Mackenzie and no. she paints all the time. She I still think things. mine was way better than yours. The subscribers did it. <laughs> In 30 minutes, you can take your drunk goggles off. Yeah! Yeah! I have such a huge headache after the goggles. So I think I may be almost done. I really think we could win. We have 30 minutes left. My drawing's coming out pretty good, so I'm gonna try to finish it up and make it look really awesome. Yeah, one minute. Left. Oh my gosh! Five, four, three, two, one. Everyone, yeah! stop what you're doing. That was a lot of dots. Clean up a bit and get ready to present. Who wants to start us off today? I will. Jess, tell me about your piece. All right, so I got blessed with the concept of a tree. So I made these like rainbow clouds to fill the tree. And then I was going with this like mandala effect for the bottom. Obviously I didn't get to finish that, but I was pretty proud with how it came out. I like how you went with some different colors for the top. It makes it very vibrant and colorful. It seems very busy at the top. Pretty less busy at the bottom. <laughs> Good job, Jess. 
Izzy, tell us about yours. Well, I wanted to initially create Lisa from Blackpink, but then I got given Jake's bird topic, so I wanted to kind of combine them both still. So I created Lisa and I made a beautiful dove because she's an angel. Yeah, I like how the dove kind of like just like swoops in a little bit. That's really cool. Good job, Izzy. <laughs> Viviana, tell us about this piece. I got flower. So I wanted to incorporate Lisa. I do <laughs> portraits mm -hmm. and I felt like making just the rose wasn't enough. So I added her face right in the center. Well, I guess your drawing makes it look like she's wearing a very fancy dress and hat. Like a shower cap. <laughs> she's very nice, Vic. All right, Michelle. So originally, I had a tree. All I had to do was a dollar sign. It is very simple. Yeah, very clean and simple. The shadowing is interesting, for sure. Thank you, John. Thank you. Whoa. Jake, tell me about this thing. I got video game character, so I decided to draw my main one trick pony champion in the video game that I play. I didn't finish it, I think I bit off more than I could chew, but I think it still came out pretty nice for what I have now. If you look at the eyes, it's actually like very detailed and there's a lot of life in there. I would say compared to some of the other ones, yours does have some richer, more vibrant colors. Good job, Jake. Kenzie. Well, I had originally picked <laughs> flowers, but then I got Lisa as a color. I like it. I figured yeah. you would. Thank Thank you. You. I, I do think you got like a nice gradient over here. Good job. <laughs> ben, tell me about your piece. So I have this little smiley face right here. He's like tripping out. And then I got shrooms growing out of this character's head because he's tripping out too. Got my optical illusion and some patterns. Well, let's say I really like the pattern and just the way you put it together it looks very complete and finished. Very nice, Ben. Good job. And as you guys know, there will only be one winner and six people with very buff legs. Steve, eliminate the first person. Michelle. Oh. It's a little simple. Get ready for your lunges. Okay. You eliminate someone else. I guess I'll have to go with Jake. It looks very good, but it's unfinished. Go get ready for your lunges. We're down to our last five. I'll have to go with Jazzy's broccoli tree. <laughs> <laughs> we have one video game character and three portraits of Lisa. <laughs> it has to be one of the Lisas. I think I'll have to go with this. I think her hair is a big part of her. I take full responsibility for this. Now we're gonna play sudden death. Everyone close your eyes. The two that pick the yellow pencil will go head to head. Is he reached behind you? Pencil. Mackenzie and Izzy, you two will go head to head right now. <laughs> one Lisa will be eliminated. I asked Peyton which one she thought was better, top or bottom. All right, she hearted the bottom one, which is Izzy. Oh! oh my All right, Mackenzie, Izzy. unfortunately, you're out. <laughs> I'm sorry. The subscriber has made a decision. Drum roll, please. And the winner is. That was a really, really close one. Oh my goodness, Mackenzie's face is turning red. <laughs> oh, 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 what is going on? Oh, are you guys fighting? All right, good job, Izzy. Come with me to see what you win for your subscriber and the rest of you guys outside for lunges. Boys and girls, lunge up the hill. Right, this pre-workout is going to make me yak. <laughs> Does it make it worse that Izzy won this challenge? Yes. It's not going to happen again. She's supposed to be intimidating me right now and she can barely get to the... <laughs> you get this piece of paper. Here's what you're going to do. You're going to draw circles within a circle. So you can start with a large one, go smaller, and then the next circle needs to be within that circle. For each circle you end up drawing, you get $10 for a subscriber and $1 for you. But if you run out of space, you run out of space. Okay. Fifty-nine and sixty. I don't think I can fit anymore. That was two hundred sixty, right? It was three hundred sixty. Three hundred sixty. You just won three point six grand, and you won three hundred sixty for yourself. Yeah!